And after the Supreme Court judgment reinstating him as the chairman of the All Progressives Grand Alliance, Edozie Unjoku has appealed to all aggrieved members of the party to join hands together with him to move the party forward. He made the appeal at a press briefing with journalist in Abuja. Habid Alawal reports. The Supreme Court of Nigeria reviewed its judgment, which it earlier gave on 14 October 2021. In the said judgment, the Supreme Court, while delivering ruling on the appeal filed by Mr. Judo Keke against the judgment of the Appeal Court Kano Division, stated that the removal of Victor Oye was not justified and the appeal was struck out. It was on this basis that Independent National Electoral Commission recognized Mr. Oye. But on Monday, the Supreme Court sat again to review the judgment. Mr. Edo Njoku had written to the Supreme Court, demanding a review of the judgment on the grounds that it was not Victor Oye, but rather Mr. Edo that was removed by the Jigawa State High Court, which was challenged at the Court of Appeal, Kanu. Mr. Njoku told the Supreme Court that Mr. Oye was an interloper who sought to join the appeal and should have been mentioned in page 13 of the judgment as the national chairman of APGA. The five-man panel therefore reviewed the judgment, corrected the error and declared the name of Mr. Dozier Njoku as the national chairman of APGA. With this development, the new APGA chairman is seeking support and commitment of all party members ahead of 2023 elections. I beg all those, these are a select committee of the NWC, all 27 members of our NWC, everybody should come down. We've not won a battle. It's an APGA thing. We have suddenly been recognized as a true faction after the Federal High Court have already said it. But the Supreme Court is the final. And then we have to be very cautious. We have to reduce the rhetorics of insulting each other because we're all one party. In his reaction, Victor Oye described the said judgment as a fake and doctored document and promised to make public the true state of affairs of the party. The All Progressives Grand Alliance Party has been enmeshed in leadership crisis for quite some time now. It is believed that deep reconciliation will take place ahead of the 2023 general election. Habida Lawal, TVC News, Abuja.